What's up everybody, this your boy Movie Man Greg coming at you guys with another reaction and I'm binging The Sopranos. This is my second episode of the day, um, but we are about to do episode six. Um, so far, we just witnessed Tony Soprano just uh, uh, kill old dude that was in witness protection. Um, so that was interesting to see. Um, but then there's a lot of stuff that's going on with his wife, his daughter, hell, his entire family. So... Um, let's see what's going to happen in the world of the Sopranos today. Um, the other thing is if you want to watch these videos unedited in full alongside with other movies, um, like full reactions, consider becoming a member. Um, you get a ton of other benefits as well. Um, but with that being said, uh, oh, to become a member, you go to patreon.com forward slash to epic or the link down below or in my community tab. All right. Without further ado, let's go ahead and start this reaction. I'm excited because I don't know what's about to happen. Tony almost got murdered in front of his own daughter. That was that was pretty wild. Alright, we already starting off with the sketchy cop. Where he beat the therapist's boyfriend up. And he's been going through some traumatic experiences. I figure this goes some Gomaria, so I uh, scare him a little. What's the big deal? That's not what I asked you to do. That's it. Here. Buy yourself an iron. <laughs> you said your suit is wrinkled, bro. Let me ask you a different question. Why a female? Why a female doctor? You know, she asks the same friggin' question. Yeah, <laughs> One thing every woman, your mother, your wife, your daughter have in common. They all break my balls. <laughs> <laughs> Most legit people I know, they'd go 100 miles out of their way not to make eye contact with me. But you, you didn't flinch. Ooh, that's a, that's a legitimate question. I want to hear the answer to that. Just in time, I was just going to make some coffee. Yeah. How's Junior? Ooh, don't you ask about Junior? This is how Junior is. Oh. That's how Junior is. <laughs> no. Are you paying someone for this game? Huh? <laughs> See what I say about this fucking poison. These kids shouldn't touch. Oh, man. For Dozen. He didn't overdose. He killed himself 14 years. Ah, oh, damn! Right off the fence. It, it, it said the, the, the current world so much that, that his head was bashing on the rocks for days before... Oh man. You don't need to be saying that in front of him. The young kids. Oh, really? What's this motherless fuck's name? Aw, oh, shit. You smell like a French poutine. It's canoe. Johnny wore canoe. Hmm. Yeah, hi. New arrival? Go ahead, keep moving, fella. <laughs> like, yeah, I ain't talking to you, bro. What certain people? Nobody got over on Johnny. And nobody's gonna get over on me. Johnny mm. liked him. And my son thinks every word that comes out of his mouth is pure gold. Hmm. So your tax hash? Ah, oh, shit. Oh. You're looking at the crackers Coyone for putting you in here. I, I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, man, his mom. What's up? Let's walk. That's it. Mm, let's walk. Tell me. What's that got to do with Junior? Junior's not so fair. Actually, sometimes I wish you just came. To just say what you're gonna say. Your Shylock business? I go to the boss of the family ten fucking minutes already, I got Ajita. Damn. You forget I wrote six gold records. No, a couple of black kids wrote six gold records. You own the company, you gave yourself a co writing credit. Come on, Ishi. <laughs> Damn. Damn. Just do me a favor, sit tight for now. Let me think about it for a while. 
Yeah, he coming at he coming at your boys. Mm, he dreaming. Oh, what time is it? It's, it's gonna be his uh therapist. It's gonna be a therapist he's dreaming about. The best. You are the best. Mm, is it the therapist? Ooh, I knew it. You okay? <laughs> Ooh, he's dreaming about the therapist. Ooh. First of all, Junior can't know how we talked. He's got to think that Hesh came to you on his own by himself. He's like, okay, so we got to start this off with a lie. Buon anniversario a te. Buon anniversario, Tony Carmelo. What is this? Happy anniversary. 18 year anniversary? Compliments of Johnny Sack. Don't do this. All right, Tony. At least I know where I stand. Mm. It's our anniversary, Tony. Ours. Not yours, mine, and Johnny fucking Sacks. Ours. <laughs> Sorry. That looks very genuine. Very sincere. Tell me, I'm lost at sea here. You've changed, Tony, and I resent it. I resent it because it's destroyed. Talking about you, the mother of my children. How the fuck can I scheme you? you? See, you see what I'm talking about right there. You're the mother of my children. Like you're not like your wife. You've you're not my wife. You know. I can make a pass at her. Hey, Doctor Melfi told me it affects different people different ways. Oh. She told you that. Ah oh, man. Whew. Another thing you gotta worry about. It's a cup of coffee. Let's just make a rule, okay? No gifts. Hmm. I usually have my answering service on when I have a patient, but I have a car emergency. Yes? Why she sound like she full of it? What does that mean? I'm sorry, I'm really sorry. So he had a dream so about you. Are any other side effects that you know of? Some people experience a diminished libido. Mm. They have a hard time getting or maintaining. Bingo. I see. Yeah, he's like, I ain't trying to have that. You saying there's something wrong with me? When's the last time you had a prostate exam? Hey, I don't even let anybody wag their finger in my face. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, I shouldn't have <laughs> <laughs> I apologize. Ooh. Mm -hmm. I'm serious. Could set your clock to it. Okay, so we know it's not a physical problem. It's a mental thing. I wonder if he gonna ever tell her that. I think I got the hots for you, Doc. Let's put that Having your dirty laundry in public. Junior knew how I felt. How would it look if I went to you after I spoke to him? Now he's got a point. Mm. Bottom line is. Mm. Something tells me you have a suggestion. Oh, Junior. There are any flies on you, they're paying fucking rent. <laughs> Let's say one and a half on a shy business and 300 on a back tax. 250. 250. what I tell you? Hold on to your cock when you negotiate with these desert people. <laughs> All right. All right, that went smooth for now. We'll see how long that lasts. Is he dreaming again? Yeah, he dreaming. You do what you want. But I'm saying maybe you could wear a nice business-like outfit. Oh, man. You know, like you're in business. Oh, fuck you, Tony. I'm no whore. No, that's not what I mean. Not like 
He he got the hots for his therapist for real, for real. Go to the cough. Yeah. Go to the cough. No, maybe dress a little sexier. But Carmela can be very sensitive. It's crazy. He's saying that, but it's not even his wife he's talking about. I mean... Fuck it, I don't know what I mean. <laughs> she has no clue. Like you. Ooh. Sweet sound. Sweet sound though. Mm. Like a mandolin. Ooh. Ooh, Tony, what you doing? Anthony. Okay, he dreaming again. He dreaming. Yeah, all right. See you Tuesday. Eesh. This was not a dream. He really just tried to make a move on her. Ah, oh, damn, the cop about to get caught. What you doing all that yelling and shit for, bro? He's a terrible tail. Wow. New. New? It has everything but the price tag hanging from it. Oh, snap. Because of you. Come on, you fucking know me. Yeah, I know you. Oh, now listen. Oh. Listen, man, I'm gonna give you a break. I'm gonna give you a break. When I toss you over. He said, when I toss you over. Ooh. 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 What happened here? Some sad shit. The motherfucker said he won't live no more. A <laughs> hundred dollars. I thought I was the only one Junior could make look like that. <laughs> See, that chunky fuck was my biggest earner. During the football season, he moved more cards than ten guys put together. That's because he's selling to kids. Because it all evened out at the end of the day. But your uncle, Madon, does he eat alone? He doesn't even pass the salt. <laughs> Damn. Damn. Is talk to him. After all, he's your uncle. Come on. That's right. Yeah, probably shouldn't. We're probably gonna make it worse. Damn. Anthony. Open the door. Your son. Playing bingo, Olivia? Oh, not tonight, honey. You know, she's a degenerate game. <laughs> Broken reading lamp you had by the phone at home. And I got it downstairs. I can bring it if you want. Listen. Those rats. I'm living next door to Gunga Din. I went down to Ferraris. I got you some biscuit. She about to lose her damn mind. What are you telling me? Tell him. No. You got his ear. He listens to you. Mm. But if anything, you know, would have come up. That's all. I don't want to get involved. Do you have something to say to you? You already involved, Ma. This lady finds me. You want coffee? You all right? Bring the cookies. Bring the cookies. <laughs> Give him what he needed all the time. You're a man, Father. You know that thirst. Uh -huh. I was too busy. For the first time, I feel like he's really cheating, and I'm the one who's thirsty. Ooh, that's deep. Let's not even think about that. That's deep. Providing a wife's duty when you were too busy with your kids in the house, you practically welcomed it. Mm. 
Damn. Yeah. Yeah, so uh, she's out of control. She's spending money like with a Sopranos or Park Avenue. But you've noticed her. How's your car? Oh. Did you steal my car and have it fixed? Oh, wow. Agreement, no Why? Why? It's a violation of my privacy. What else have you done? Oh, man. Oh, is he gonna tell her? I love you. Anthony, what the fuck? I'm in love with you. Let me talk. No, it's not the Prozac. I dream about you. Oh shit! I think about you all the time. Oh shit! I can't get excited about any other women. Oh shit! But nothing else to say. I love you. Oh! Let me start here. This is the Prozac. <laughs> me all of the things you feel are missing in your wife and in your mother mm. like there you go again bringing my mom up you're making me out to be some fucking mama's boy but you are but you're a mama's boy okay forget it I'll see you next week Jeez. Man, that was a hell of a therapy session. You fucking with me? No. Octavia became Augustus. What? But he loved him because he never ate alone. Gabish? It was the longest time of peace in Rome's history. Mm. Talking about Augustus. He shared his wealth and all his people loved him. He said that three fucking times. I'm trying to tell you, Uncle, but you ain't listening. Are you okay? You've been acting mezza morte lately. I ain't seen a long face like that. Mezza morte? It's just bullshit stuff. Don't worry about it. You sure? Yeah, yeah, I'm okay. His, his uncle side eyeing him like, nah, it's something more to this shit. I don't want the fucking job. Let Junior die from the stress. So it gave Jackie the cancer, God rest his soul. Mm. Those are some beautiful horses. Nice I can't stand this. Shit. Flies all over the <laughs> No bills. No headaches. No family cotsies running around. One horse likes another horse, they go up to each other, they fuck. That's it. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck I'm talking about. <laughs> <laughs> you old fucking Jew. Here's my share. You think I'm gonna profit off of your tax? <laughs> oh. That was nice. So he only paying 200. Mm. That's what's up. See, he got some stand-up quality, especially when it comes to his people he supports. I was jealous of her ability to help you. To be a sort of salvation to you. Hmm. Calm, you're not just in my life. You are my life. You are my life. Bam! Yeah. Come here. Aww. He's so full of shit, though. <laughs> okay, I'm no good at speeches. Yeah, you almost fucking dime. You'll hear some great speeches. <laughs> uh, John, why is shit sideways? Are they trying to say something? Is this poison? And he's saying to our new boss. Salute. Oh, that's a camera. Oh. Oh. Damn. Got 
photos of all of them. Capo. Hmm. He's the new boss, Junior. They just like, damn. Oh, man. They on target. Oh, shit. Yo. Oh, man. Hey, that's that's crazy because th that's a that's an element that's new to the show. Like, yeah, they've been breaking the law and, and you know they're part of the mob, but we never seen any kind of like police activity against them. Now we know they they're building a case against them. Like they know who the players are. They know who the boss is, the captains. They got in on the. Yo, this is a whole nother, a whole nother. A whole nother element to the whole story. Like, I didn't even think about you like as far as them breaking the law and all that other stuff. That's so what I like about Yeah. Damn, there's a lot going on. Hold on, hold on. Let me get my thoughts together. Let me get my thoughts together. So it's so much going on. He's starting to learn about himself. He got the stuff going on with the therapist. We haven't seen Chris this episode. Um we're seeing how the organization is working from top down to the bottom. Um, we got introduced to New York a little bit, but I really, I'm really intrigued to see what's going to be going on. Like, you know, last episode, they talked about one of the rats, you know, the guy that Tony killed. I wonder if they're going to dive in a little bit of the backstory about that. Um, man, I, yeah, I'm watching another episode today. This is about to be my third episode for the day. I'm excited. Um, but again, hey, thanks again for watching. Whew, I don't know what's about to happen. I don't know what's about to happen. Um, but again, thanks again. Make sure if you want to become a member, uh, do so by signing up on patreon.com forward slash to epic or the link will be at the bottom or in my community page. Um, but with that being said, thanks again. I'm, I'm really, really, really enjoying the show. I'm really, really liking it. Um, but yeah. Uh, thanks again. I will catch you guys on the next episode that I'm about to watch right now. That's right. I'm about to watch that shit right now. But yeah, I catch y'all later. Peace on the next episode.